So the doctor said, if this is my thermometer, where's my pen? Hot cash! Going to Hot Topic to see what kind of uh, shit we have to, shit they have there so we can spend our hot cash. We buy a shit ton of pops. Look at all this cash right here. Here you go, baby. Why don't you uh, <laughs> go buy yourself something nice on me? Go ahead. Oh, thank you. You're very welcome. Look at that. They got Mike TV. That's awesome. I know. Oh, look, here's uh, Augustus Glue. Oh, even better. They probably have them all then. Yeah, they probably have them all. It's Charlie, the grandpa, uh -huh. Veruca, Mike TV, uh, I want that one. Violet Beauregard. I love that. And Augustus Glue. Okay. All right, let's go look for them. All right, I think we made out pretty good at Hot Topic. We got about five pops, a dorb, and just something for me and my dad. We're definitely going to come back tomorrow. We had 13 fucking hot cash uh, coupons, right? Right. 13? And uh, we only used three. So we're going to come back tomorrow. The lady said, what, she uh, she's expecting a box? Tomorrow. Tomorrow. She's about 10 boxes tomorrow. So we're going to come check out, see if they have anything room good. And... Uh, I think next week she said they're getting a lot of boxes. Yes. Okay. So. They get shipments every day. All right. So, so far today we did pretty good. Here are two of them that we got. Let's start off with this one. We got a Hot Topic exclusive. It's an Aloha stitch. I don't remember him dressing up in the movie like this. Uh, it might be. I think there was a cartoon series of Lilo and Stitch for a while. But yeah, he's number 203 in the in the pack. Uh we have pretty much all of these except for these two, but my wife doesn't like these. So yeah, this is uh, one of her picks that she really, really liked. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. Again, I don't remember him dressing up like that in the movie, but I'm assuming it's for his uh, cartoon series. All right, going down the start. After this, it's nothing but Willy Wonka. Let's start with Augustus Gloop, number 332 for this series. Now look at all these fucking cool pops. Originally, it just came out for the, with these two. I guess the second wave came out, and now you can get all of these guys. The only thing is, I think this is a San Diego Comic-Con exclusive, but we'll talk about that in a little bit. Okay, now here's Augustus Gloop uh, in the, his little attire. His uh, I think it's uh, he it was a little rich guy, right? Or no, that was Veruca Salt. But anyways, he's a German little, I love chocolate. He's a German little guy fucking eating his chocolate and fucking just a chubby little motherfucker. Uh, if you remember correctly, he is the one that fell into the river of chocolate in the first, well, actually in both of them, didn't he? But yeah, look, give him a fucking tan and it's me, you know, pretty much. All right. The next one is number 329, Veruca Salt. Now here she's carrying the golden egg from the goose, the goose's golden egg. And I think that's how she, yeah, that's right. That's how she gets eliminated from that big contest from Willy Wonka. She fucking, uh, the, there's a machine that, that uh, calculates the egg, the size, and it tells you if it's a good egg or a bad egg. She accidentally gets on it, and it says she's a bad egg because she was a spoiled little fuck. But as you can see, oh, shit, she's got all these freckles right here in the middle of her face. That's cool. I don't remember her for having freckles. Yeah, you know what? Yeah, I do. She had a shit ton of freckles in the movie. But she's got her, uh, her little... Uh, dress on that she wears in the movie and of course the egg which is pretty fucking badass she was a pain in the ass a spoiled little piece of shit all right now the two that i'm gonna unbox is it's this one it's grandpa let me see uh, grandpa joe he is number 328 out of the series and here you go it's nothing it's it's, it's pretty plain jane other than the fact that the face looks a lot like him, and they did a really good job with the mustache, the receding hairline, the you know the the baldness actually, and the comb over, really really good. Um, tuxedo, not his tuxedo, but he had a suit on. And but what I really liked, <clears throat> in this case, the face made the pop really really good. Uh, they did such a good job with the with the sculpting and all that stuff. And this, if you guys remember correctly, it's uh, let me see if I can. There we go. Fizzy lifting drink. This is what got them disqualified because they wanted to claim the prize after they thought they won the contest because everybody else was out of there. They were the only ones that, I guess, survived. Because, <laughs> uh, anyways. But, uh, but yeah, and that's when fucking Willy Wonka loses his shit. He's like, you get nothing. Good day, sir. But, yeah, I really like that one. Uh, mainly because of the face, the sculpt itself, and the fizzy lifting drink did really, really good. Okay, and the last one I'm going to unbox 
It's this one. It's Mike TV. If you guys remember correctly, it's the guy, the little kid who always liked to dress up as a cowboy, which is fine. It's very plain Jane. The the scope itself is kind of plain Jane it's, as well. Uh, I guess it kind of looks like him a little bit. The only reason why I'm unboxing him and why I really like this pop, it's because it comes with this little guy. Look at this fucking thing. I'm just going to put him aside right over here. There you go. Look at this. He's about as big as my finger. The first segment on my finger. Look at that shit. Really, really. I'm going to have to zoom in on this motherfucker. A really, really cool pop. This, of course, is the outfit he was in when uh, when uh, it was that big camera that Willy Wonka shrinks these chocolate bars and he wants to send it to people in their houses so, he could re, uh, so they can grab it and just eat it from there. But this is such a great fuck and i love it when they come with little little bitty bitty tiny pops so this is actually i guess i guess like a two-pack but not really but yeah so you're gonna get this one and this one this one is okay but this is what really caught my attention i really love this one a lot but anyways guys hot topic is they the hot topic we went to um they said they're gonna get about 10 boxes more tomorrow we have still have a shit ton of fucking hot cash so we're gonna go tomorrow and then next week they said they're gonna have a big shipment now what the lady also told me was that they're gonna get the sdcc exclusive on july 21st mark that in your calendar guys the san diego comic-con exclusives where hopefully we might be able to find this one and maybe this one these two are the only ones that we didn't get 327 and 331 this one I know is a San Diego Comic Con exclusive. I'm not so sure about this one, Charlie with uh, with the golden ticket. But July 21st, that's when you got to get to Hot Topic and try to be the first one there to get all the new exclusive guys. All right, guys, that's gonna be it for the, uh, this video. If you liked the video, go ahead and give it that big thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to Everyday Random Shit. Don't forget to like us on Facebook. Both of those links are gonna be down below in the description. Until next time, everybody. Peace out.